Today we're gonna take a look at Style 3D Atelier and Simulator, the new digital clothing creation and simulation suite for the CG industry. For transparency, this video is actually sponsored by Style 3D, but everything said here is of our own. So Style 3D Atelier and Simulator were launched around 2023, and they offer an easy workflow for garment creation aimed at CG artists CFX artists, game developers who work in animations, cinematic production, video games, virtual human live streams, and anyone who needs a way to create high quality clothes in 3D. And after testing it for a few days, I think Atelier, depending on the nature of your work, it is worth integrating into your workflow. And aside from being free to try, it has a couple of things going for it. Not to mention the Style 3D research team, which already published six technical papers that were accepted by SIGGRAPH this year about various new technologies and approaches to class simulation. Now, during the time I spent with it, workflow-wise, it didn't feel that different from other digital fashion software like Class 3D and Marvelous Designer. The main difference that I noticed right away was the interface. Stealth 3D Atelier interface looks cleaner, because it has less clutter, fewer buttons overall, but function-wise, I feel like they are basically the same. But what I think Atelier differs from the other competitors is its fast GPU-based simulation and automatic features like auto-rig and auto-quad rematch retopology, not to mention the pricing and the simulator plugin. Right now, Atelier released a free version, which lets you explore most of the software without losing a penny. As for the simulator plugin, I think it might be a game changer. And I'm not talking about the cloth simulation engine inside Atelier, rather, I'm talking about the Unreal Engine plugin. The main standalone software is called Style 3D Atelier. Don't ask me where the name comes from, because I don't speak French. Or do I? Okay, it means a studio or a workshop which is fitting, I guess. This is the main software that will help you create all those stunning multi-layered garments. The other one is Style 3D Simulator. This one is for Unreal Engine, and it is a plugin for creating high-fidelity real-time simulations. Basically, it integrates itself with Unreal and enables you to run these cloth simulations on any character. And I have to admit, they look stunning. But I think what artists are going to appreciate more is how much this plugin can save you time and headaches. For reference, check this Adami waifu rendered in Unreal Engine with multi-layered overlapping garments by artist Hirokazu Yakoha. And you can clearly see how the simulator can handle complex geometry with minimal effort. When using this plugin, you can run simulations straight inside Unreal in a fraction of the time. Instead of the traditional Olympic cache export adjustment and record, not to mention the huge file sizes, so using the plugin can be a replacement for the huge Olympic cache files or the Unreal Engine cache. In addition, the cache size for these simulations are extremely small, making it really easy to deal with and adjust, but more on that later. Now let's check out Atelier. I know if you check the promotional materials and the website, you are probably gonna feel like this is the best and most innovative software ever created for digital clothing. And while this is true to a certain extent, Atelier is really good. The performance is great and its simulations are super fast and the learning curve is basically almost non-existent, at least as far as software in this category are concerned. So it is essentially another garment fashion and clothing creation suite which offers the usual 2D pattern and the workspace with all the sewing and editing tool sets and 3D preview viewport. But there is more. For example, you have an extensive library of resources with thousands of assets, all sorts of neat assets like fabric types, trims, stitches, puckerings, zippers, buttons, avatars, and so much more. But where Atelier shines is its GPU-based simulation because it enables fast simulation and in the process, it saves you a lot of time. Secondly is retopology, the quad-based remesher, which is even more powerful in this new version. With a quadrilateral retopology algorithm characterized by stringent constraints and minimal singularities, blah 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 and other stuff. So all you need to know is that it achieves amazing results with clean quadric topology. The software also has a ton of tools like Animation Editor, UV Editor, and Mushroom Topology Tool, which actually works surprisingly well if you want to export that low and high poly combo. 
you can also turn your mesh into quads very easily, in addition to the bake tool for baking like maps, and even a few beta tools like garment fitting and auto rig. So needless to say, once you are in here, you're not gonna need another software, at least until you want a texture or use your garment on an actual engine. And that's where Style 3D Simulator comes in, and I admit that some of the stuff I've seen here are just impressive. The speed of the simulation, ease of use, and the elimination of the back and forth import and export that comes with Alembic Cash Export, which still plagues the industry to this day, are all remarkable. A lot of studios are usually working with Ncloth of Maya and using Houdini Cloth simulation tools. This is because they need to wait paint exactly which part of the cloth they want to simulate and which part of the cloth that needs to follow the body. I know this might seem like it is too complicated, but from what I can see, Style 3D can do that automatically and it is really easy to set up inside Unreal Engine. Now, I don't think I have to say this, but a decent machine will go a long way when working with the software and plugins, but if you are already using Unreal or any digital clothing or 3D applications of this sort, you probably got that figured out already. But in the off chance that you don't, it helps a lot to have, for example, an RTX 3060 GPU and above when working with these tools. When it comes to pricing, Style 3D Atelier offers, as I mentioned before, a free version, which basically allows you to pretty much experience the software for free, apart from a couple of advanced features like Auto Rig and Auto Quad Remesher. Right now, there isn't a set date or limit on the free version, so it could be a week, a month, or a year. To be honest, Style 3D were adamant about including that, so if this sounds interesting to you, I encourage you to click the link in the description and try the software for yourself. So at the end, Style 3D at 2 a is an extremely powerful tool, and the simulator plugin is even more powerful for game developers and VFX artists. And even beyond that, Competition, I think, is a great thing, as far as end users are concerned. And since I didn't know that Style 3D existed before, and now I do, I will be definitely using it in my work. So if you want to check out the software, its full list of features and all those good stuff, links will be in the description down below. I hope you guys found this video useful and informative. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.